Here's today's prophetic word concerning you. Now make sure that you take a moment and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Make sure that you hit that notification bell that every time we upload a new video, you get notified. If you would like to receive daily prophetic words straight to your email every single day, make sure to hit that very first link down in the description as well as check out the other links to connect with us better. Now, I heard God specifically give me a word for you. And the Spirit of the Lord said this, I am not mad at you. You haven't let me down. I truly get you. I truly understand you. I know that you're trying to make sense of everything that's happening around you right now. I'm not holding anything against you, says the Lord. I am healing your wounds and the places where people have hurt you and let you down, says the Lord. I see right now you standing at a crossroad trying to make a decision in the spirit right now in which way you should go. And I hear God saying this concerning you. I'm going to do something new for you that you have never seen before. Get ready, says the Lord. Don't give up. All power on heaven and on earth is my gift to you. And it comes without repentance, says the Lord. My gift and my miracle is upon your life. God just said, I will build everything you need and I'll put it together. You don't need to worry because I will take you farther than you could ever imagine. I received a word from God concerning you that said that you're taking the final test before your breakout. The Holy Spirit reminded me of Abraham's story where God had a promised him a promise that he would be famous all over the world and that his name would be great. And I feel like this promise is on your life. That promise came through Isaac. And then there was a day when God asked for that promise back. The Holy Spirit showed me that you have been giving in to random thoughts of feelings because this promise has been taking a long time. So it's beginning to frustrate you. Even though you know better, you believe in the promise. You feel like nothing has been happening, but God just said this concerning you, that he is making sure that you are able to handle this call in your life, that he will make a way to make your name great and raise you up in this season to see this come to pass. I hear him say, can I trust you with this power to walk it out? Can I trust you with millions, says the Lord? This is the last test just before your breakthrough is what I heard God say. God wants you to know this. Don't get too stressed out about your situation because something is changing for you right now. God's power can make any situation change in a moment. I want you to comment hashtag yes Jesus in the comments down below as your prophetic act of agreement. He has made everyone. He can reach and touch anyone in any time. He's the creator of everything and everything bows to his name. Think about how important that is and let it motivate you in this season. I prophesy the Holy Spirit refreshment over you that are watching this right now. Jesus is stronger than any situation that you're facing. Everything in your life that goes against God's good plan for your life must come into order right now in the name of Jesus. Your joy is coming back. You're getting stronger again. I see in the spirit that your supernatural power to prophesy and heal with your words and your touch is being manifested through you. 
I see your faith stirring up right now as you're even hearing this, an increase in promotion, increase in your growth, in promotion of abundance of blessings are coming to you, says the Lord, and they shall overtake you in the name of Jesus. Your next blessing is going to be life changing. I prophesy elevation over you in the name of Jesus. You must shift and receive this by faith, by God's glory. Now, I want you to take a moment and just ask Holy Spirit, if you can become a victorious lifelong partner with this ministry, or if you could sow your best seed into your situation right now. Now, whatever Jesus puts on your heart, that's what we desire you to do, nothing else. But your seed of faith planted into this prophetic soil, I pray will enrich you with the favor and blessing that's been upon my life in Jesus' mighty name.